How'd they clear my throat? Who's the man? I'm the man. Say I'm the man. And welcome back to Super Liminal. I realized that when I was uh, doing the outro for the game, I kind of called it Super Liminal. Super, super, super Liminal. You know what? Screw it. Forget what I said. We're going to go ahead and try to solve puzzles continuously again. So I'm just going to break this real quick. Perfect. And we're moving on. We're still in the dream, by the way, from last I left off. I don't. I played this like a while ago, so I don't really remember everything, but I'll try to remember as much as possible. Oh, that's right. Okay. I thought we were going to open the door, not pick it up. We're going to keep on with the brain length and, uh, you know, keep the brain going this time and see if we can actually do things. Those are bolted to the floor. How am I supposed to pick that up? Um, shit, I need to find something I can pick. Wait, 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 wait. You know what I can bring over? I can bring over the door. Yes. That's what we can do. Holy shit, we're geniuses. A green for green. You get it? My goodness. Uh, it says exits that way, but I kind of want to go this way. Are you serious right now? Holy shit, if I keep doing that, my game's going to break. <laughs> cool, that's fine. I didn't want to flick that one down anyways. What is up with this room? Why is it doing this? Should I climb it? I'm a genius! Like, holy shit! I made a staircase out of doors! <laughs> Who does that? Oh shit, I actually thought this was like we were gonna jump off something. That was just a wall. Attention! Dr. Pierce requires you to note the following risks of dream overexposure. Significant memory loss, both quantitative and qualitative. Hallucinations of dreaded or annoying objects. Yeah. Unrealistic beliefs about the lengths of hallways yeah. and other side effects which have not yet been discovered or which cannot be understood. Uh-huh. It says right click to return. I don't want to. I don't want to return though. How do I do this? We go. There we go. Is that a way up? Yep. Ew! Damn it. Hold on. Freaking let's try this again. Let's click that. Okay, I can't click that one. Ooh. Nice! Right click to wake up. Pfft, who wants to wake up? This is a freaking dream, you know? I can do anything here. I can... My crosshair changed to a smiley face? Oh my gosh, it's a smiley face now! My crosshair changed into a smiley face. Why did it change into a smiley face? What? The, what? Wait, what? It changed back! What, what, what was that? What, what, what was the point of that happening? I will do this forever if I need to. That's bullshit. Almost if I drop something on top of it. Hey! I'm a freaking wizard. You're a wizard, Harry. I love changing the music. Oh, well, that just happened. Well, this is just apples completely multiplying, you know? Why do I walk in front of this? Nothing. There's nothing. What the heck? What am I supposed to be doing here? Am I just supposed to... I think I'm just supposed to walk up there. Oh, this is like a drop-off over here. What the heck? Ooh, what's down there? Do I dare go down there? Should I jump down there? Hold on, let me check what's up here first. Uh, you know it's yellow. I'm going down. Well, that didn't really change much, now did it? How am I supposed to activate this button and get through? Hmm. 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 I can feel the winds howling in my ear. Right click to return. Oh, 
I get it now. Damn it. Come on, you can make it. It's just... You've got to be shitting me. Screw you. Wait. Wait. I have an idea. I have a freaking idea. My brain just expanded. I think I know what to do now. Okay, here we go. So we stand up here, right? Oh, here we go. Yeah! Yeah! Big brain. Warning. Dr. Pierce is frantically submitting numerous spelling and grammar mistakes into the standard orientation protocol in a desperate attempt to counsel you. Okay. I have no subroutine to correct these errors, but I cannot compromise the integrity of the standard orientation protocol. Why not? You will not receive these messages. They would not make sense regardless. Oh, try me. I'm a genius. My brain is huge. Did you see me just solve that puzzle earlier that took me like 15, 20 minutes to solve? No. Well, that's fine. I need you guys for stairway. Damn it. Uh, Got it. Okay, cool. Oh, great. Return. I don't think it matters. Still cannot flick that down. It's disappointing. Damn it. Okay. Can you not do the sky thing? It kind of messes my brain up. Oh, a flashlight. Oh, a brain. What is that supposed to mean? How to start it. I can't read that. I'm not going to try to read that. Uh, oh, chess. Oh, science. Ooh, a lot of things. Is there an, uh, is there an Attention. elevator in here? Dr. Pierce continues to input significant errors. I will interpret his basic ideas. Hello, my introductions are redundant. I am a real doctor who went to doctor school. VR has never been a mistake. I can help you, but I also do not know how. Okay. Transmission ends. Interesting. So you're trying to help me, but you can't. It's okay. You don't need to help me. I'll be perfectly fine. Perception is reality. Cool, cool, cool. It's cool. It's good to know. Good to know. Seems like perception and reality in this game is like everything, you know? That looks trippy, bro. Fire extinguisher. Oh, hello, radio. Hello. Name is my Pierce Dr. Glenn. Hello. To the Somnusculpt Welcome Experience, team of your care leader, patient years 10 development. Conditions struggle you whatever with? Professional invention. Edge science with cutting, a tomorrow can bright. And buts, no ifs, or look good. You know, I think you're having issues, bro. Why are you speaking like Yoda? What the heck? Um, what is this? What if I forget to set the alarm? Beep, 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 2.08 a.m. p.m. Wait, which one is it? Is it a.m. or p.m.? Emergency exit protocol. And why is the elevator with a skull shape? Eh, screw it. I'm sure nothing bad will happen. All right. Turn that alarm off. Thank you very much. Relaxation room? Oh, well, this is different. You know, I could use some relaxation. Maybe relax the brain a little bit, you know? What do we got? What do we got here? Oh. Can I sit down and relax? Let's sit right here. This is truly, truly a relaxing experience. As we enjoy the clouds flying through the sky into the nice blue, beautiful sky. As they flow around, as they fly. Truly remarkable. Where's the porn? Um, let's see here. Uh... Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. Oh, you fixed yourself. This nice. is a notification that you have reappeared on our monitoring system after a prolonged absence. Okay. Please continue to do whatever you did most recently and discontinue whatever you were doing immediately prior to that. What I want to do. Ha! Ah, broken soda machine! I love breaking things, man. It's so fun. Oh, well, down we go. Okay, we're here now. I see the little house. Can I get out here like this? No, I can't mess with the door. I don't think I can mess with that one either. What's up with this little house? Okay. Well, I just got to enlarge you, right? Hey, perfect. Oh, I might have made you too big. Hold on. Shrink it down a little bit. There we go. 
Perfection. Flick that down. Drink. Soda machine. Haha, <laughs> broken. For some reason, I couldn't click that. Uh, fire extinguisher. Oh, someone's moving out. Oh, it's like a little tiny exit thing. Hold on. Oh, oh, wait, there's a back entrance. Oh, no, there's not. Okay, I'm just in like, it, that was just some like, inception type shit. Okay, that should work, right? Yeah, that door's big enough. It's so cool. The perception side of this game is freaking amazing. Okay, I thought that would have been a, uh, you know, message, but it wasn't. It was not a message. Yo, dude, this game, honestly, like, is trippy at times. Okay. Where are we at now? What's up with this TV? Does it play anything? It's a red wire. I'm gonna follow it. Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn I'm Pierce. sure we already know this, man. In we already know your name. In addition to continuing and discontinuing as mentioned earlier, uh -huh. Please also disregard any unsettling experiences that you may have recently had. Everything should have now reverted to being soothing and therapeutic. If this is not the case, you may be receiving this message in error. I think everything's perfectly fine. Oh, that's the light, bro. I thought something over here was creaking. All right, well, now. Ooh, this is a new room. Oh, it's Jenga! Would you look at that? Do I actually have to blow it over? Oh my gosh, do I have to blow over the Jenga? Please tell me I get to blow over the Jenga. Oh my gosh, I'm blowing the Jenga. I'm blowing it. Let's go! That's freaking sick. That's so cool. Oh, oh. I love it. I love it so much. All right, I'm coming to the door. Bam. Now we're in. Okie dokie then. Um... Now what? Oh! 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 And I go! Woo! Haha! <laughs> Freaking genius. Why is this place so much bigger? Oh? I can't mess with that. Okay. Whoa! Whoa! Uh, this is so weird, man. Hello. My name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and I'd like to read you my favorite inspirational quote by me. Okay, what's it like? The worst thing you can do is focus on negativity. It won't spare you from the cage of death, the pain of disease, the cruelty of time, the cold shell of human nature, or the eventual loss of everything you've ever held dear. Whatever you do, don't focus on that. It's kind of hard not to now. After you stated all those facts and deals, you know. So I mess with this, huh? Bouncy castle? Bouncy castle. Yep. Here we go. Damn it. Okay, so what do I do? I make it a little bigger? I do that, right? Yeah! 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 Damn it. Okay, what am I supposed to do here then? I think I got the idea. Okay, so what I gotta do is I gotta get on top. I glitched it. I glitched through the doorway. <laughs> and was able to get inside. <laughs> All right. <laughs> that was not how I was, I was supposed to do it, by the way. That was not how I was supposed to do it. Shit. No, no, no. Freaking turn it around, right? And then bam. There we go. Now I can get out. Hopefully I can get through. I can. I don't know how I fit through that. I wasn't supposed to be able to get through that, but I did anyways. I'll take it. I will take it. Hello, Mr. Glenn, Dr. Hello. Glenn. My name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. Yeah, 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 and we I'd know. Like to thank you for triggering every single one of our 823 emergency protests. Oh, snap, I'm a superstar. This I'm the best one you got, right? In improving the system for future patients. Oh, great. Congratulations. Thank you. Anyway, you're now headed in the right direction. So we should be able to initiate the emergency exit protocol shortly. Oh, that's awesome. That means I can get out, right? Oh, I see what we have to do here. <laughs> okay, then. I got an idea. 
Holy shit, that's buggy as shit. I need to move this a little more to the right. Okay, there we go. You've got to be kidding me. Wait, what the heck? Wait, what the heck? Wait. Wait, what? Wait, how did that happen? Hold on. Wait, what? The box? Wait, hold on. How did I make the box smaller? Gimme throw! Holy shit, how am I supposed to do this? Like that? There we go. That was the most trippy one I've ever done. I'm so confused. How did I shrink the chest? Ah, I don't get it. I, I did not get that one. That one hurt my head. Okay, let's make this a little bigger. Perfect. Let me out. Let me out. I want out. Oh, thank God. Five or six dream is the absolute limit. What's the emergency protocol to the emergency protocol? <laughs> Imagine asking that question. What the emergency protocol is for the emergency protocol? <laughs> That's the worst question to ask. That is literally the worst question to ever have. Oh, we are awake. We have to be awake for re we're not awake for real. Never mind. I just turned around to this. So what are they trying to do to get me out of here? I'm so confused. Emergency exit protocol initiated. Oh. Please prepare to conclude your Somnasculpt experience in 10, 9. My game froze. Eight. Oh, I'm back. Error. Error. Oh, well, by. Orientation there we go. protocol. Stand by for analysis. Uh, I'm not going to stand by. I'm going to continue moving forward. Because that's what I do. <laughs> I keep moving forward. That's a lot of blood. Error analysis complete. You are exhibiting signs consistent with an increase in fear, hopelessness, and frustration. This is inconceivable, as Somnasculpt therapy is proven to correlate with a decrease in these emotions. Well, not for me. I'm freaking out, apparently. My character's like, you know, high-end, like, stress. Destroy that. This is just a random block on top of there. This has been, like, the most random level ever. Hypothesis. Patient was improperly oriented. Conclusion. Oh. Conclusion? Impossible. Reformulating. <laughs> it's impossible for a conclusion. She just started buffering there for a moment there. I'm sure you'll get to a conclusion soon. Improved hypothesis. Oh, here we go. Patient requires additional Somnasculpt therapy. Conclusion. Emergency exit protocol cannot proceed. Emergency exit protocol has been emergency destroyed. Okay, we have a problem. Instruction. Continue with Somnasculpt therapy indefinitely on an independent basis, as all orientation resources have been exhausted. This concludes your standard orientation protocol. Goodbye. Okay. Peace out. No! Oh, freaking shit! It's a puzzle game! It's not a horror game! Let's get the shit out of me! I, I was so confused. There's no way I'm awake. Did they just, like, reset me? Did they reset me? Am I reset? There's no way I'm awake. Hold on. I'm about to check something. Give me a water. Oh, is it one of these endless loop bullshits? I gotta keep moving. I gotta keep moving. I gotta keep moving. Damn it! What, what, what am I supposed to do? What does it want me to do now? Wait, that's not the alarm. Okay, I'm starting to get worried. Oh! 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 <laughs> okay, game. I see you. That's a pitch black hallway. I'm gonna go down it. Oh! <laughs> this game knows how to mess with your head, man. It honestly does. Okay. Where am I at now? I hear another alarm. I'm back. Oh, well, that's different. Oh, uh, oh, that's different. Can I go through it? Damn, I can't phase through it. Okay. 
This is bizarre. This is very bizarre. What's up with the music? Why is it so inspirational? What am I supposed to do here? Oh! Oh! Okay! Do I go through the painting? I do. I don't? I do. Hey, hold on. Here we go. Wow, that is actually cool. That's really cool. Mr. Glenn? Uh, Dr. Glenn? My name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. Thank you I don't like for the completing music. the Somnusculpt Standard Orientation Protocol. Before you begin the first phase of therapy, I'd like to briefly describe the finite and fragile nature of the dream state. Dude, I hate that because it feels like something can come crawling down and grab me. All right, Dr. Glenn, what do you, what's the therapy for? I'm perfectly fine. Hello, red chest piece, I see. What the, what? Wait, what? Wait, huh? Yep. Oh. Okay, we're here now. Oh, this dude, this is gonna hurt my head so much. Okay, turn that off. Up, oh. and down we go. Now what? It's like a weird thing here. Can I like jump to the other wall or something? Uh. Oh, here we go. Oh. Oh shit. Okay, so how do I get to that? Do I have to... Can I pick this up? I cannot. I have to use the door, right? Oh, check this out! The door fell and broke this open. Okay. I feel like I've been in some of these rooms before, but I could be wrong. Oh. Oh, there's an opening here. It's like a tear in the wall. Make sure I'm not missing anything. Okay. Hello? Oh, bro, I'm, I'm breaking reality in this dream. Of course, nothing is more challenging than the difficulty of changing perspective, of fundamentally altering your perceptions in a way that will enable you to face dire trial-by-fire scenarios with solutions that could not be found otherwise. Okay, so it's like teaching me how to, like, you know, break through, and that's a weird block. Can I somehow, like, grab that? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold on. What if I come all the way over here? I back up, move a little bit more to the left, back up a little more. Oh, well, you know, never mind. That was the trick me. <laughs> this is so brain freaking messing, bro. Oh my goodness, okay. Oh no. Ooh, shit. What's up with the upbeat music? I'm gonna run. I don't know if something's chasing me now. Guys, I am- my mind is actually, like, exploding right now. Exit temporarily removed. Temporarily moved. Okay. Then what do I do here? Oh! Okay, well, you know, I just have to turn around. Dude, I'm so confused. I'm just kind of going through it. I know I haven't been talking too much, but that's because I'm, like, really into this game right now. I'm like... Exit this way? Okay. Up. Oh. Go right. Okay. Oh, okay, it's like dinging noises. Okay, let's keep doing it. Let's keep doing it, let's keep doing it. Okay. Okay. This way. What do you mean? That's bullshit. That's bullshit. What? Wait, what? Why are you leading me to... I'm so confused. What? Why is it doing this to me? What do you mean wrong? I followed the sign! There we go. So then if I can't... if Perception is not reality. Okay, cool. Then what is perception supposed to be? I'm so lost. Am I doing the wrong thing? It says this way, right? If it says this way, there has to be something, right? There's something I'm missing. Or I'm not. Okay, this is bullshit now. I'm starting I'm starting to get confused. Oh! 
can't get up there. Okay. Why does he keep pointing this way? There's nothing this way, dude. Okay. All right. I just keep going. I'm just going to continue going. I'm sure I'll get it wrong. It'll be like, eh, you know, a couple times, but I'll just keep going. Let's keep going. I'm going to keep going. <laughs> I am so lost. Why isn't it ending? I'm so confused. This has been going on for far too long. What happens if I get to the vent? Can I get to the vent and get out? Can I vent out? Would that be sus? I don't know, man. I'm, I'm just so confused. <laughs> I'm losing my mind. I'm actually losing my mind. What is going on? Why am I si just infinitely going through this? <laughs> what? what do I do? What do I do? Where do I go? It's been endless. It has been endless for the past 15 minutes. I have not been able to get anywhere. I've been here way too long. I've been, I'm starting to lose my mind. Is this how people go insane? Where they just get trapped in an area for like 24 hours? You know how like they stay in one space for like a while? They start to lose their minds because they started getting like lonely and stuff. They're alone going through something random continuously. Oh my gosh, that's how I feel right now. I feel like I'm trapped inside a freaking hallway of infinite hallways. Never ending. Never, never going to stop. It just keeps going. Dude. I'm getting angry now. How much longer is it going to do this to me? I've been here forever, dude. Mm. Mm. Oh, dude. Why? Why? Why is it doing this to me? I, I don't get it. I don't get it. <laughs> I want to scream. Oh, I want to scream. Oh, I want to scream. Oh, I want to do it so bad. Oh my goodness. I, 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 I don't, I don't get it. I've been stuck here for ages. I've been going down the same corridor for ages. I've been seeing the same thing for ages. Oh my gosh, dude, I can't. Oh, I can't. I can't do this anymore. How much longer am I going to go for? Why? Why are you doing this to me? Why? Why are you doing this? This is bullshit. Oh, what am I supposed to do? Wait, the clock changed. Did the clock move? Wait, that changed. Wait, that changed. Wait, hold on. I'm so confused. What did I do to make that change? How did I make a change? Wait, how did I make that change? No, give me an answer. I don't understand. Now it's going left. What? What the hell? Okay, we're getting somewhere. We're actually getting somewhere. Hold on, that changed. How did that change? How did I make that change? How did that change? How did I make that change? It changed for a moment, but then it changed back. And then I'm sitting there and I'm just like, what the heck am I supposed to do there? You know, I don't get it. I, it, oh, I can't do it. I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. I can't understand it. What? What? Wait, do I have to keep looking at it? 
Wait, is that what I'm supposed to do? Okay, it has to be something with staring at it, right? So I stare at it. And I guess whichever direction I look first goes, right? So I look left, it's not there. I look up, okay. Then I do it again, right? The next one's I have to go left. So if I look right, then that one's there. And then I go this way. And then I do it again. And it says... I don't remember this one. Was it left again? Yeah, it was this way. Okay. Okay, so it's facing left again. So I look at this, right? And look that way. Look up. Okay, it's this one again. Then I look at this again. I keep staring at it. And I look right. It's not there. And we have to go right. Okay. Oh! Yes! Oh, yes! Oh my god! <laughs> I'm free! Holy shit! Get me out of here! I'm done! I'm done! I'm done! This game's over and Oh lord, you've gotta be kidding me. You have gotta be joking me, son. This is bullshit. Get up here. Alright. Oh, dude, I made it. I finally did it. I finally completed that section. The torture that I had to go through. Are you kidding me right now? Finally, while we respect the unique progress of every patient, you must understand that it is possible to completely exhaust your supply of dreams. Thereby entering a state in which you will not be able to wake up, even with the help of triggering mechanisms. Okay. Down I go. Okay, now we're here. It's a hallway there. Okay. This game is getting trippier and trippier the more I progress. Okay, nice bed. This seems a really fancy bed. I just want to get out of here. My brain is so destroyed right- Okay, game. Okay. Oh, I don't much appreciate this, man. This is- Alarm? Alarm. Alarm, 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 alarm. What the hell? Okay. This is getting weirder now. Oh, now it's an infinite freaking- I don't know. Elevator maze? Just keep going straight. Screw it. I'm sure eventually I'll find the exit. Up, oh, arrow. Okay, go right. Go straight. Oh, okay, good. We're good, we're good. Please listen carefully for the sound of an alarm clock, which will automatically play if you are approaching a destabilizing dream weight. Okay, click. Oh, oh my gosh, dude. The freaking, oh my God, this game. The game is messing with my head. Oh, bro, this is... The elevator's gone. The elevator's gone. This is some SCP, um, I don't know, backrooms type shit. Are you kidding me? You can't be serious. It's a freaking square. It's a giant box. This isn't even, like, endless. It's, ju it's just one giant box to mess with me. You've got to be kidding me. Do I go this way now? Okay, well, you know, that's cool. This game, man. This freaking game. This game is so cool, but it's such a mind screwer. Oh? The level is loading. Okay. This is a new room. This is different. This is a computer. This is, this is my computer setup, guys. I obviously have a chessboard to my right, I think. This Hello? Is highly unusual. It appears you have entered the Sonascope Diagnostic Framework. Patients do not have access to this dream. Wait, what is this? Diagnostic warning. Unrealistic use of dream objects may result in dream integrity fail states. 
Okay. Oh, it's like one infinite loop. <laughs> what? Oh, wait. What if I put this in here? What if I put the thing inside the thing itself? Oh, and then it becomes one infinite loop. Holy shit! Let's keep going! Oh, sweet lord, what did I do? Oh, okay. Well, I think I just broke the game. I broke the game. I just broke the game. What's happening? What's happening right now? What just... <laughs> Is this supposed to happen? Okay. Well, you know, I've been kind of falling for a while now, you know, it's been kind of, uh... But it's kind of fun, I just decided to get myself a drink, I came back, you know, and, uh, I'm still falling. <laughs> this is the longest fall in the world. Hey, I'm almost down to the ground now, look at this. Yeah. Whoa, be careful with that. Oh, wait! Hold on! I just realized, I made myself super tiny, am I supposed to go to the, underneath the door here? Oh my god, this is gonna take ages for me to get to. I'm so far away from it. Oh, I'm so far away from it. Dude, this is gonna take forever. What did I just do? What did I just do? Oh, I did something that I didn't mean to do just now. Does that mean I have to go through that door now? Oh my god, it's gonna take ages for me to get to. <laughs> Alright, I restarted the level. I was way too small. It was taking ages to get to. So I decided to completely reset. Here we go. And we're in. Then I grab it, right? How do I grab it? Like this, right? And then bam, and I put it in there. Okay, there we go. Now I can actually get to it. Um, I think I did a bad thing. Oh, okay, well, how about I go through it again? Maybe it'll fix it. Maybe it'll fix it if I go through again. Didn't fix it. Well, sayonara. I think I'm waking up. I think I'm waking up. Did I dream overload? Is that what I just did? What the hell am- where am I? Where did I end up? <laughs> what is this? Not an exit? Okay, cool, that's what I was looking for. We're going to the exit, the not exit, you know? Woo! -hoo! Oh, I thought we were gonna fall down. Oh, okay, yeah, we are falling down, we are falling down, okay. Here we are, oh, we're continuing falling down. I can grab this. Get out of my way. We're continuing on. We're just gonna keep trucking forward, you know? Just figure this is so bizarre. Oh! Well, this is a new area. Hello. My name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. Hi, Dr. And Glenn. Many years ago, I had a dream. Oh, Martin Luther King I style. I found myself in a place where I understood that each of us begins as nothing where everything I perceived was shaped by seeing it exactly the way I wanted to. White space. White space? Oh, that's this area, right? Okay. Interesting. What's so special about this zone? This is so bizarre. There's so much happening, and I'm, I'm freaking so confused right now. But I will say this game is absolutely phenomenal. With the whole mind, this like you know, mind screwing. Oh, we're back in our apartment. Okay, we're not in our apartment anymore. We're here. Flick. Okay, I see something over here. Right. I fell down. It says that's not an exit, right? Oh, here it is, right here. Bam. 
I found it, apparently. An accident. I didn't even see this. Okay, we're going this way. Alright. What the hell? Dude, this is so cool. This is so cool. I'm actually loving this right now. This is so weird. It's so weird. It's so weird. This looks like the Windows logo on your computer. Wait, how do I get up there? Oh. Okay. Okay. <laughs> this game, honestly, never ceases to amaze me or surprise me in any form or way. But in white space, I also faced the greatest challenge I could imagine. Because with a lifetime of life itself behind me, and all of the weight that it carried, I realized that seeing things the way I wanted to was not as easy as it used to be. Oh, really now? Oh, is that a light switch? Can I flick the switch? Did I do a wrong thing? I think I just turned... I think I just made the white space a black space. <laughs> Wait, there's a stairway here? Wait, what? Wait, what? Oh, wow, that's not confusing at all. Hold on, how am I supposed to do this? Oh! Oh! Okay. That makes more sense now, actually. I go up the stairs, okay. Oh, now I'm falling. Oh, dude, this is so baffling. It's just... There's so much confusion. It's so much confusion for me. This is too much for my brain to handle. This is actually way too much for me. I'm starting to lose my mind. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's something I can do, apparently. Oh, well, there you go. It's just... <laughs> I have to think outside the box, I guess. Dude, what is this? You're well beyond dreaming now, and further out than anyone has ever come back from. But we hope that you won't get discouraged. Uh-huh. After all, if this is a place of pure perspective, isn't it also a place where a different point of view could make anything possible? <sighs> so bizarre. Isn't that why you came here? Yeah, you know, yeah, you know what? I like the way you think. I like the way you think. Oh, I know what to do here. Okay. Oh, well, you know, I just realized there's probably a secret with these, right? So I use this for that these spaces, right? How how does this work, right? How does that make sense? Okay, so that's there. That's here, right? Oh, I see now. Okay. I keep, I almost keep clicking while I'm on top of the space. Here we go. Just in case. All right, we're good. This is way too bizarre for me right now. How do I do this? Oh, okay, there we go. I just put the thing through the door and apparently it worked. That's so weird. Okay, interesting. <laughs> I don't know how that worked, but it did. <laughs> that worked somehow. Oh my gosh, dude, this game is so long. This, there's so much going on. Like, I don't, I, I, I'm, I'm getting lost now in all this. Oh, there we go. Okay. Okay, this is, it hurts my eyes a little bit. This is so weird. This is so weird. I have no words to describe what's going on. I, I literally have none. Exit? Please. Wait, am I free? Am I out? Was that the end? I can't do any- oh, okay, yeah. 8 a.m.? Cool.
Wait. Am I awake? Am I actually awake? Hello. My name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. And by now, you may have realized that all of this has happened exactly the way it was supposed to. You see, everyone who comes to the Institute does so because they feel that they are no longer in control of something important to them. Uh-huh. Like what? Because I'm very confused right now. But, more often than not, the problem is not that the problems we face can't be solved. The problem is that we become so afraid of failure that we refuse to see our problems from a new perspective. And so, we do the same things again and again and again. And therein, of course, we find exactly the failure we were looking for. I actually like that. I actually like what he said. Is he gonna say anything else? Oh, he has caution tape on the bounce castle now. Dude, this is so cool. I really liked what he said though, like through failure you can find success. You just gotta keep failing and failing until you succeed. It's a good touch, I like that. Your life will always be a struggle, and you will always have problems. But today, you have the chance to see things differently. Even though it meant facing obstacles that seemed impossible at first, you thought outside the box, and you overcame them. Because you saw things from every angle, you understood them for what they really were. Because you kept moving forward, no matter how far off the path you were told you were headed, or how unexpected it became, you found your way. I like that! I like that a lot. You're seeing things in a new perspective. I love that. That's such a good message to the game. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, I like that so much. In a few minutes, you'll be back in the real world. And some part of you will say that None of this was real, so how could it have really meant anything? But just We're going all the way the back power of perspective itself, it will have been as real as you believed it to be. All you've got to do is wait up. That was amazing. Wow. That is fantastic. I love that. I love that so much. I love that message to the game. I have a new perspective and like outlook of everything that's going on. Though you fail, you can always like have another like perceive another way of finding a solution to be able to succeed in that ordeal that you're dealing with. That's freaking amazing. That's such a great message to the game. I love that so much. Oh my god, that's actually beautiful. I freaking this say this game has been amazing. This game has absolutely blown my mind. Absolutely like made me actually have to think outside the box of figuring things out in some of these puzzles. Because there's so many times where I got completely stuck, but because I kept on pursuing and continually every time I failed, I found a new approach to the problem and tried it and I was able to succeed. I love that so much. That's such a freaking great example. This is a fantastic game. It, comes across with such a strong message that's freaking fantastic man is there an ending to the credits all right there's no ending to the credits apparently that's, that's it that's the game ladies and gentlemen that is super liminal i hope you guys enjoyed that video of super liminal it was definitely something different the, of a genre on this channel because i play a lot of horror games so i really hope you guys enjoyed a little bit of a switch up with a puzzle game because i i truly truly like adored this game when playing it excuse the voice crack all right but anyways i hope you guys enjoyed if you did let me know what you guys thought in the comments down below and if you guys are new to the channel hit that like button and that subscribe button down below to help the growth and i'll see you guys in the next video peace out everybody